Dr. Barth Green has been taking care of patients here in South Florida for decades, but today the renowned surgeon performed his final surgery at Jack's Memorial Hospital, and now that he's retiring, his colleagues gave him a very befitting tribute. CBS 4's Francis Wang with the details. Over 50 years and more than 15,000 surgeries later, Dr. Barth A. Green getting a standing ovation following his last, and he's taking in this moment. I think the most important thing is what I was taught by one of my mentors here is the past is history, the future a mystery. Each day is a gift. That's why they call it the present. Dr. Green may be retiring from his surgical practice, but he'll still have a busy future serving as the executive dean for global health and community service at the University of Miami Health System. I believe that, that the opportunity to help people will be even greater now than being tied up in the operating room 30, 40 hours a week. And Dr. Green has many layers. He has many stories you wouldn't have imagined outside of the surgery room. I was kidnapped in Medellin, Colombia, by the Cal in Cali, by the Medellin cartel. I was the doctor of the leader of China after the Cultural Revolution. His son was paralyzed. I was in Russia, being followed by the KGB. So I've had a very exciting life. He certainly has. He also has quite the sense of humor. I wouldn't change anything except my age. At the core, Dr. Green is someone who cares deeply for his patients and always aims to connect medicine with humanity. In 2012, we were there with him in Haiti following his Project MediShare, which opened one of the only critical care hospitals in the country, saving countless lives. I'm not sure that I've changed the world, but I like to treat patients like family. And speaking of family, it's his family who, despite all of this fanfare, he says, keeps him humble on a daily basis after long days in the surgical room. He says he has to go home, and before he gets to eat, he has to clean up dog poop. <laughs> so you know what they say, happy wife, happy life. From JMH, I'm Francis Wang, CBS 4 News. Words to live by. I learned that one a long Absolutely. time ago. What a career. Congrats to him.